Dear colleagues, this is FICO emulsification of a cataract with grade 3 nuclear sclerosis. In this case, hydrodissection has not been done at all. Let us see how FICO emulsification can be done without hydrodissection. This video is a tribute to Dr. Naran Bardului from whom I learned this technique. This technique of no hydrofeco. Dr. Naran Bardali says this is pure feco. And he never does hydrodissection in his feco surgeries. By this time, the incisions have been made. Only one side port has been done. And now, capsulorexis is being done with the help of uh, uterta forceps and this is a nice round rexis. Now hydrodissection will not be done. Just some more viscoelastic substance is injected and the tip of the FECO handpiece is introduced into the anterior chamber. The bevel is towards the nuclear mass. Some cortical matter has been removed. Now the bevel is turned towards the corneal endothelium. And now the tip is buried into the substance of the nucleus and the nucleus is chopped. And now stay there for a few seconds so that fluid goes through this crack and goes from center to periphery. You can see this is reverse hydro. Now this is a chop towards 7 o'clock. And this free nuclear fragment is emulsified and removed. So without rotating the nucleus, we just removed a piece. Now the tip is turned towards the left side. And this portion of the nucleus is sealed. And this is a chop at 3 o'clock. And another piece is removed like this. And now I turn again to the right side. And I find that the nucleus is moving. So by this time, hydrodissection has been done by natural movement of the balanced salt solution inside the anterior chamber and within the capsular bag. And now one portion is there. I just find that this is also rotating. So hydrodissection occurs naturally if we just work on the nuclear mass for some time. That's it. Nucleus and epinucleus has been removed. Little bit of viscoelastic substance is injected into the anterior chamber and now this cortex is to be cleaned. This is a 23Z Simco cannula. And see how easily the cortex can be removed. So, no hydrofeco means hydrodissection has not been done before nucleus management. But hydrodissection is occurring naturally during nucleus management. Why we should do some cases like this? Because in some cases you will find that hydrodissection is not at all good and the nucleus is not rotating nicely. And you will be very much afraid if you don't know this technique. So, this is a very simple technique. Just 
chop the nucleus into some fragments, remove those fragments and hydrosection will occur naturally and you can manage the nucleus like this. Now this is hydro polish. The posterior capsule is very clean and now this is intraocular lens implantation under irrigation. And dear colleagues, this is an unedited video and you are watching something like life surgery. The haptics have gone into the bag. The lens is still boat shaped. It has not unfolded completely. That's it. And now, this is the final lavage of the anterior chamber with balanced salt solution. At this time, Viscoelastic substance that sticks to the corneal endothelium comes out. Now the antechamber is formed nicely and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for watching. Hope this video will inspire you to do some cases without hydrodissection. This is for the experienced surgeons and not for the beginners.